Hello and welcome to Dad at Play, Nintendo Switch Launch Edition. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, why are you showing your face again? I'm trying something different and let me know what you think. Um, here's my thoughts on the Nintendo Switch. We don't have one in this house. Um, and we're not going to have one for a while. There's a couple of reasons. Uh, first is that, well, you know, it's kind of pricey. First, you've got the uh, the console itself. Um, you're going to have to get um, at least one or more uh, controller, additional controllers for that. In this household, there's um, we would need a minimum of four. So, um, because that's just how many kids there are. Um, and then there's the games. Um, let's look at this list of games here again. Uh, there aren't a heck of a lot of games that are out right now that sort of justify the price for my family. <sighs> Granted, my 13-year-old is absolutely salivating over that Zelda game. Um, now, don't get me wrong. Um, there are some great-looking titles uh, coming up. Bethesda, why Skyrim? I mean, really. Um, why not at least Elder Scrolls Legends, the, the card game? So, and we don't have that sort of disposable income. Uh, and another, re another reason why we're not, uh, we don't have the Switch in this house, um, Nintendo's PR, uh, now, I've been covering video games for years. Used to be with, you know, a couple of different websites, and then uh, GamerWeb, um, okay. over a dispute over pay, I wound up launching my own website, uh, Digital Entertainment News, and uh, covered video games for a good long while there. And in all of my time of covering video games, um, Nintendo has always been troublesome, uh, to say the least, uh, with regards to uh, being forthright with their PR. Now, I'm, I'm specifically looking at you, Golan Harris. Uh, Nintendo farms out a lot of their PR to Golan Harris, a PR firm. A lot of companies do this. That's great. I have found um, Golan Harris expects coverage without providing anything for it. Um, whether it be, you know, the consoles, games, whatever. They, you know, and so, you know, you don't want me to cover it, I won't cover it. This is probably a lot more coverage than I should be giving. So anyway, the, um, yeah, I'm, I don't have a happy relationship with, with Nintendo's PR, you know. Who cares? Well, absolutely zero obligation to uh, go out and get a Nintendo Switch uh, just to, you know, talk about the games that, you know, that are there. And, you know, and, and that price, man, I'm like, sheesh, it's expensive. Um, and I'm not saying I'm not going to wait until, you know, the price drops before I get it because chances, you know, I mean, the thing is we probably won't wait. Um, it might wind up being a Christmas present. That's my thoughts on the Nintendo Switch launch. Did you get one? What do you think of it? Uh, I'm leaving the comments open. Uh, let me know what you think of this whole thing. Uh, I'm not so sure, but I've been told to, uh, to show my face more, so here you go. All right, keep playing.